Hi there, and welcome to Mundelein, Illinois for Xfinity On Demand. I'm Aaron Kern. Tonight, the Mustangs of Mundelein play host to the Stevenson Patriots. But right now, it's time that we turn our attention off of the court to see who has the most supportive student body tonight in our Game of the Week, Battle of the Fans. Right now we're at Mundelein High School. Patriots are up 6-3 right now. It's gonna be a great game. Stevenson's gonna take it home. At our school, you know, we got kind of a swagger. I mean, we're known as a smart school. We're known as uh, pretty good at sports. We're almost a powerhouse. Um, we just gotta take it to the next step and everything. Mundelein's a pain in the butt. There are conference rivals all the time, football, baseball, basketball, you name it. They're always our rival, we're always competing with them. We have like a lot younger team than we did last year because a lot of the seniors graduated, but we're doing a lot better than what was projected. Who are some of your key contributors? Well, we got uh, Matt Morrissey out here, lockdown defender. Uh, he'll guard their best guy. Connor Casha, you know, his brother just graduated last year. He was a key part in our offense. Um, we got Jalen Brunson, you know, he's a sophomore, he's dominant. Well, if I'm Stevenson, I need to get the ball to Jalen Brunson because he has Tommy Gandolfi on him, and that's a clear mismatch. Brunson over Gandolfi, gets two and one. And Jalen must have said, hey, Cameron, I hear you. I'm going right to the basket to get, to get the score. Tell us why you have the best student body at Stevenson. The best students. Well, let's see. We got the most kids. I mean, uh, you know, we can, we can bring the house, all right? We'll show you guys. We're creative. Even though we're on the road right now, it doesn't matter. We get loud, we get crazy. We're missing a lot of our fans, and it doesn't matter. We're still the loudest here. Our stadiums, like no offense to Mundelein, but are a lot bigger than here. So we have a bigger like student body come. Like theirs is really impressive, but this is like nothing for us. Like it seems like a lot, but we probably have like five times the amount at home games. Like no matter what sport it is. What, what are these that we're seeing right there? These uh, big posts. Absolutely, you know, me and my buddy actually made those posters of cutouts of our athletes. And we just go wild turning them around, and you know, it's just great. What makes a Patriot better than a Mustang? Tell us what a Patriot is, why is it better? Well, like, even historically, like, Patriots are, they're like our, kind of like our symbol of the country. Mustangs are just like a horse, like, they're an animal. Oh, obviously a Patriot is like someone that goes to war, is always 100% on the field. A Mustang gets killed in action and war. I've like grown up in high school here with all these kids that are playing, so it's kind of neat like seeing them play since they're on varsity now. But yeah, it's just like kind of nice, like being a big family at like such a big school. Stevenson's always been a big rival to us because they're the richest school in the county pretty much and they, they think of us and we're not, we're not anything so we don't have football, we have basketball so when we come out here and play basketball it's, it's a big deal. This year Robert Canari tore his ACL so we were down at the beginning of the year but they all like they came together as a team and they've been doing a lot better. On the floor right now who are some of the key uh, contributors you have? Um, definitely Sean O'Brien, Cliff Dunnigan and Chino Abube. Chino Abube is great. He, he dunked 13 last game. Pretty cool. Sean um, is the smartest basketball player I've ever played with my entire life. He, he, he can play any position he wants, and he's going to Southern Illinois on a full ride. Dunnigan going all the way to a Pube. It's hammer time in Mundelein, Illinois. He's going to Pube. Yeah! Tonight we have a blackout, which is actually for our 50 year um, scorekeeper, Jim Ackley. He was a very big part of our uh, program. So we're going to block out, commemorate him. I think our student section stands out from others because I feel that everybody's really committed and we really have a dedication to our school. We want the seniors to come out every night and show the freshmen that they this is theirs when, when we leave. And next year, when we leave, the Jews will take over. So we want to make sure that they're always welcome here. Our student section, they always love to get into the game. They cheer really loud. They love chants. And they always yell louder than the other team. We're a smaller school, and we everybody is so together, and we're all one. And they have so many people, and their student section, little weak. It's a little weak. 
Oh, they're sitting down. Look at them. Look at them. I swear they're sitting down. And we're better because look at us. We got it all the way back to the top. We're the best. Go, Red Wings, I honestly love being a Mustang. I think that the dedication, like I've said before, is it's full. It's a full blast dedication. And I feel that being a Mustang is just, it's truly something I'm passionate about. So much pride. I mean, our basketball team is awesome. They've been doing so good for four years. And I mean, it's, I love being a Mustang. I wouldn't be anyone else. <laughs> We gotta do this for all of Illinois. We gotta take back state. It's ours. It's ours. We're taking back our city.